Welcome to the new series of the Defro Show. Right, today, um, basically what we've done is we've trained this morning uh, and just had a fairly light day, I would say. Uh, this afternoon, nice chill day. I presume a few of the lads got a massage, um, played FIFA, um, table tennis, pool, the usual. And uh, I don't know, I suppose the, the boring lads had a little sleep. Today, I think, uh, you know, I'd definitely say we've got a special guest on the show. Someone who, well, I see him first hand really, every day at training at Tottenham. Um, his first call up to the senior squad. So he's been buzzing about the place, to be honest. Um, he's been a bit lively. And uh, yeah, and I'm, I'm looking forward to interviewing him. And uh, yeah, so here he is, Andros Townsend. Woo! <laughs> nice. Get on, bro. Nice shape up. <laughs> right. So um yeah just <laughs> just a just a just a just a just a quick just a quick chat just a quick chat um you know there's been a lot there's been a lot of a talk about you um last season you went on loan to QPR um done unbelievable um am I right in saying that you got young player of the year and uh, yeah basically just wanna just wanna ask you how 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 did that go when you went on loan how did you feel at the time and uh, how do you think it went um obviously it was a big loan for me first loan in the Premier League and. I was given the chance to, to to play games really, and that's that's how, that's what you want as a youngster. And I've <laughs> played 12 games at QPR, and I'd, like it was a good chance for me to showcase myself, not only for QPR but for for Spurs as well. Okay, and uh, so the question is now, obviously, um, do you feel ready that you could can come back in? Obviously, I know that you've done well pre-season at Spurs, you started the season. You know, you've been in the team. Do you think that you can, you can go on to be? Do you think you can be going to be, you know, consistent throughout the season and and basically just show people, you know, what you can do at another level, obviously at a bigger club? Yeah, of course, that's the aim. You know, as you said, I've started uh, the last four games, so uh, but I know I need to continue that now and not rest on my laurels. And I've got rewarded for my fine start to the season, but I know I've got to continue that. And uh, I want to ask you. I understand that you're, you know, obviously uh, you're a good family man, and you know um, you're quite close with your dad, uh, Troy. Um, what was his reaction when you got called up to the to the full squad? Yeah, of course. Not only my dad, but uh, my whole family were obviously happy for me, and uh, it's, it's kind of it's like a uh, like a dream, like a dream come true, really. And obviously the whole family, I was getting texts all, all night from them. I, I'm just I'm just happy to that I got the call up, really. That's fantastic, ladies and gents. Um, we're going to uh, go to. Yeah, of course, because obviously we were playing Moldova and uh, this is my first time in the squad. Yeah. What, what, uh, and your previous experiences, uh, how did you find Moldova? To be honest, I thought they were, I thought they were a good side. Um, on paper, obviously, people look at it and think it should be should be an easy game. But um, as I always say, no game's easy at this level. But um, I don't know. I think I remember scoring after about. Yeah, yeah my sources tell me that you scored. Yeah, you, you know. Um, through that goal, Jimmy. Well, basically, I think Ox got the ball and uh, just uh, textbook JD run really, where <laughs> I just go that way and then dart the other way, <laughs> and then it's, it's just after that, it's just one of them ones where I think if I go through one on one, you can just I don't know maybe go and get a drink because you know the outcome. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can you talk us through your goal against Scotland as well in the previous international? In the what? Against Scotland. I don't know if I think if you if you I think if you look back at the video or if you recall just having a meeting, you didn't really see me on a pitch. So I don't know. Maybe you're talking about the goal in a warm up. <laughs> okay, thank you. Cheers. <laughs> you can't come for me, bro. I'm too sharp. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, everyone. Uh, hopefully, we'll have someone else to to interview tomorrow. But um, yeah, I'll surprise you later. Well back! Rooney follows up and England have the lead. Well, it falls to Lampard and that's what Frank Lampard does.